lakini leo nilishangaa kuona watu wamefahamia hii ploti na mangrainda na mapanga na marungu na wakaanza kupomoa pomoa nikawaomba wati wasitufahamie sababu sisi hatujui tu sisi ni watendaji ni tendaji na hatujui ile mambo iko kwa kwa, kwa kwa wenyewe wenyewe kwa wenyewe ndio wanajuana wakafahamia waka wakafunja funja milango wakaingia kwa ngaranji vile mnaona hii ngaranji vile iko wakafunja punja hiyo milango wakaingia tena kwa hii nyingine wakafunja wakaingia hapa wakafunja tena na mpaka hapo ndio wakatulia wakati wamesikia polisi wanakuja na wakati polisi wamekuja hakuna hatua wamechukuliwa wamewachiliwa tu na wakaambiwa wawache hiyo maneno kwa watu kama saiti ya 20 sababu hata mimi sikuwa nimetoka kwa nyumba yangu na nyumba yangu ndio hii iko hapa na nikatoka nje nikauliza kwa ni kuna nini nikaambiwa nyamaza mzee ama tukukujia I was woken up by many phone calls from my client Susan Kamau who is the owner of this place uh, the home state and uh, the information I got is that uh, they are away they are not in Nairobi and there are some a gang of goons uh, uh, heavily armed with uh, various crude weapons who had raided uh, this home state and who are breaking into the house and causing damage and demolition and uh, she asked if there is anything i could do about it and she needed me to uh, take whatever action i can uh, but she warned me not to come here uh, on my own uh, because uh, those people are armed and dangerous and she asked me if i could help get uh, help from the police so uh, very fast uh, very quickly i made a report at uh, gigiri police station and i reminded them that we had made a previous report uh, last year regarding uh, this uh, this sort of incident and uh, I was able to get help so uh, some police officers from uh, I think Gigiri and also police officers from Runda police station also came to the site and uh, when we came we found some of those goons were lined up along the road uh, and they were not even scared actually uh, for some time they're not even worried they were continuing until I think uh, some officers from the uh gigiri the dci and uh, some of them starting running away jumping over whatever so there was all that commotion our efforts to establish the truth or what really was the motive has not been successful uh we do not know what these people were after i've been away from home for a while and when i was away out of town i got a call in the morning from my house girl telling me that there are a number of guys many guys outside my compound with rungus uh, with pangas vandalizing the place so i had to make a round turn and come back home i was told they were they destroyed my daughter's uh, the house doors to my daughter's house and uh, a garage i have rented a tenant they vandalized it they removed the gate and i'm not sure no. and property was destroyed also went into my banana banana plantation I had bananas and some maize and they cut them and carried them and threw them away It's visited home to see the damage to assess the damage that had been done and sure enough I found doors broken the gate down so the only sensible thing to do was to go straight to the police station So I went to Runda police station and I reported and I even took an OB and I'm requesting I'm asking that they do they hasten investigations about this because my our lives are in danger I don't know what could have happened if the goons had found me at home we are living in fear we are quite afraid and we are hoping Runda police station takes this up seriously and figures out how how we will we'll, we'll, we've lived there for more than 30 years we need to know that we are still safe that they are there to protect us and to do an investigation to find out who was behind this and why they were doing it we had a long standing court proceeding as the family and uh, property has uh, the the judgment already was given and we're in the process of division of property so 
Because these properties, some are really prime, there's the chance that this is malicious intent to a pers from a person who is discontented. But even if it is, there are methods. There's, the country isn't broken, the systems aren't broken. There are methods to, 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 to get your qualms hard because this, this feels very intentional and very malicious. And it almost makes me wish my dad was still alive because maybe he'd have had a better say or he'd have stopped them. But my mom and I are not safe. We are the only two in our family.